Hi, I'm Richard. I am a web and iOS app developer and today I want to tell you how to learn a programming language. This is my method and maybe it's not the best one, but I like it. The best way for you is to use it for two or three weeks and then understand if it's good for you uh, or not. So let's get started. The first concept you need to fix in your mind is that you can't learn a programming language in just two days. It requires time because you have to learn many concepts and practice them. It requires dedication because you have to work hard um, and it's not always easy. And it requires constancy because you have to allow your brain to make all the connection and the best method um, is to use some time every single day. An important question is where? Where to learn a programming language? Generally um, there are two, um, maybe three ways. The first one you can buy a book on Amazon and read it. The second one you can buy a course online. There are many platforms and for example I'm using um, Udemy and edX. Or the third one um, you can use meetings. I've never tried to make meetings but um, I learned the C language at university so it's a bit similar. Anyway, I prefer the online courses because you can find many examples and you can ask the teacher many questions. And now I want to talk to you about theory and practice. And I will do it using this diagram. Here is your knowledge which starts from scratch and increases. And this is the theory part. And this is your practice that starts from um, scratch and increases. This is the practice. Now we have three charts and the orange one, the uh, red one and of course the green one. The orange one shows um, a lot of knowledge but a little practice. And this is a problem because uh, um, if you don't practice every single day you will forget the rules, the keyword and many many other concepts. The red one shows um, a lot of practice but a little knowledge and this is another problem because you will be able to build to create only simple project and of course you can see the green one which shows many practice and many knowledge this is the best way so this is my advice um, if you want to learn a programming language you should use um, some time every single day and you should divide it into theory lessons and exercises and it doesn't matter if you use one hour, two hour or 30 minutes every single day. What really matters is that you're using some time every single day. There are many tips for learning a programming language. Um, you will also learn them with experience so don't be in a hurry, um, take your time. But I've got a last tip for you. Um, you should share your code, um, your works, your uh, programs with your friends and maybe also the teachers because nobody knows all the keyword and that's one of the reasons why um, we often ask for help. You have to remind that a good developer is also a good researcher. But I want to give you a last last tip. Um, I like to use this small um, notebooks. Every single notebook is for one section. For example, this is for the Swift language, so IS development. This is for web development. Um, this is for the C language. And this is, uh, this is a surprise. I take many many notes because I, I know that I can remember every single word, every single keyword and if I've got problem then I can search it here. So this is my last last advice very helpful. Okay, so that's it. Um, hope you liked this video and if you have got any questions please write it in the comments below. Um, this is Richard, see you!